What's going on, guys? Uh, we got cameraman Will back. What up? Why were you sad a while ago? <sighs> it's tough to say. I don't know if I can say on camera. But guys, I also have some bad news. I had been trying to get into the UW Husky Classic meet on February 11th in the 3K. The entry standard time to get in was 8.10. I had only ever run 8.11. Uh, I thought that that would be enough to get me in, and it definitely would be enough to get me in if I was still running with Brooks or with my college team, uh, or if I had an agent. I don't have any of those things. I can't be mad at the meet for not being able to race because I don't have the entry standard. Um, you just have to respect the system and run faster. I really am keen on racing a 3K, so I'm going to keep looking around, try to find some more races that I could do on. I, I think that I am in very low age shape, maybe even under age shape, especially in the next few weeks once I tune up a little bit. This is just, I think, the first realities of not being with a team, the, the real Strug Pro realities. Uh, I have to do a better job of organizing a meet schedule. Um, so anyway, the workout we're doing today, 16 by 400, the most 400s I've ever done since eighth grade, I wanna say. We're gonna start off at 70, work our way down just naturally. One minute rest. Yeah. How are you listening to music on your runs, Ben? Bringing your Garmin. Phone? Oh, shout out to them. Buy your Garmin watches. I do not have a discount code, but Garmin is the best watch out there. No questions asked. All right, see you guys in 20 minutes. I was just saying to Will off camera, I took a huge in the woods. Guys, I'm about to begin, like I said, 16 by 400, 70 working down to 65. I think that I'm not supposed to go much faster than that. And you know, you can say what you want about this workout. It's not supposed to be a barn burner. It's mostly supposed to be introducing and getting comfortable with like 65 pace eventually. And like, you know, if I go out too fast, all of a sudden I have 13 reps left at 65 and I don't want to necessarily do that. So we're just gonna play it by feel. Uh, I think I'll be okay and uh, just slowly work it down naturally and get used to that pace. Oh, 
Is that six in? How are you feeling, Spence? Six in. Feeling pretty good. Just gotta focus up for the next four. Just close your eyes. I can't believe we've been through this for so long. Pressure is on. One to go. Ooh. My arms just feel numb. I gotta get back in the weight room. guys that was an interesting one so probably ran my last 10 reps close to 66 pace or faster but I feel like about like I can't go any faster than 65 right now 
Last rep I went hard, went 63.3. So I guess I can if I'm more like in a kick. But it's just interesting because my body hasn't been like this before. Um, I'm just a lot more aerobic than I've ever been. So in doing that, I've sacrificed a lot of my uh, just immediate pop and speed. Um, so, you know, I'll probably start hopping on some pull-ups here and there to get my arms back a little bit. Like, I haven't been using my arms at all all fall just because this, the uh, strength work hasn't required it. But, you know, I felt like by the end of that super flat. But at the same time, I was averaging, like I said, like probably 66 for the whole workout. So, really good day, but just kind of every time I do a faster workout, it's like I'm upgrading to what my new max speed is. So right now it's like 65-ish, but maybe in a few weeks we can work it down a little bit. Flash forward two days later, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. It was a barn burner workout. My legs are still a little tired, but I've got another workout coming up tomorrow. But I quickly wanted to say I did a podcast with Emma Abrahamson and my girlfriend, Allie. It was it's weird. Uh, that's all I'm going to say about it. Um, we just basically we're all friends. So it was not like a podcast. It was like us all just having a conversation. I think you guys would think it's hilarious. Hopefully if you understand our type of humor. So go check out that uh, podcast down below. It's called Conversations Over Cold Brew. I'll leave a link down below for it. Support Emma, support me, support Allie. Listen to the podcast. I think you guys will enjoy it. And with that, we'll see you soon.